Ananta heads it out. Bimal wants to receive that. Kawas lines himself up. The much taller and the much well built Asarov was guarding that one. But it wouldn't have mattered because it was an offside already given. We're void to take the pass in. Kiran Koch, Kiran Limbu has been kept really busy. In the first half, he started with the two lovely diving saves. And then he was overpowered by the Tajistan strikers. And the start of the second half has already been kept very busy. Sir Wolves has it away. Fatakullo was the star of the game. Safely done. Back to Kiran. The crowd is getting behind them. This is one. They still hope that the team can pull the win off. Anjan Vista. Suzal Swesta still. Viraz Maharjan still. And they have been. Oh, that was a challenge. I don't think there was any fall there. It's brought down then Anjan Vista. It's going to be a free kick from about. Uh, 30 35 yards out from the goal line but yeah this is this is a good strategy now Nepal have changed their formation 4-3-3 three, three, they're playing with the two defenders Biraj Mahajan and Kamal Thapa big one Kamal Shrestha will be playing as the wingers from the midfield and then of course Sujal Shrestha and Rohit Chand will be attacking will play as uh, attacking midfielders Vimal Gharti Magar Delivers the ball in. For the moment, that looked like it was going to kiss the back of the net. It's uh, just missed the goal post. Just a little too high. Good attempt there from Bimal Karthi Magar. That will give him plenty of confidence. Goalkeeper Makabo must have his heart in his mouth when he saw the ball approaching to him. And with the trajectory, it just misses it. It just went off the post. But that was a good strike from Bimal Kartimagar, who has been the prodigy of Nepalese football and has already started to show his, uh, some fresh legs, was substituted for Nabiyuk Shrestha. Viraz Mahajan taking it from the left wing and is brought down. Both are down, both came in for the fall and referee not interested to take any cards and he wants the play to go on and fall giving his Nepal. Yevos, Nazarov sticks it easily, not in a rush to pass it. Haywire, Amir Baik, and they're still in the danger zone. Oh, they are uh, defenders converging in, makes a rare shot. That's a haywire shot. Here in Jump Jump Jum has no trouble, but just to face the ball from the line. At that time, the defense working for them. You have to get your body behind the player. The physique of the Tazakistani players, it will be challenging, but you have to still put your body in line with the attacking player. Otherwise, you won't give yourself a chance to defend it well. Again, attacking, moving the ball forward. Charlie Lov. Charlie Lov, long distance effort. Oh! Kiran Limbu diving to his right. The ball evades the goal post. Had that been a little squarer, would have kissed back of the net. Look at that. Oh, well. Diving effort. Didn't get a touch on it. So, goal kick then for Nepal. Not one goal kick is attempted to pass short. And not one has found a Nepali shirt in the first touch and uh, well you can't score from that can from there can you probably in a futsal match you can but uh, football it will require something quite extraordinary frustration has started piling on to Nepalese player they're just trying to they are in so eager to hit the ball get the ball to the post that they're just making some haywire shot the earlier one could be the perfect example. He could have passed and make the opportunity. But over here, they're just trying to build a game plan. And once again, this could be opportunity. 
Burris Kowas passed it to Bimal Ghartimagar and again a nice play done Viraz Mahazan coming from oh well defended there here's the head and ball is still in position still in play yeah every time they have an attacking opportunity they get nervous and they crowd uh, surround the ball when they have to be unmarking themselves to the best of their potential the forward players we haven't seen that so far in today's game and the score line will reflect that for you two nil down is that the pressure of being 2-0 down? Is that the pressure piling up? They are playing like this because the, when they started, they started very good. And now second half, you know, like, is that the, that's playing in their mind that they are two goal down and they cannot pull it from there. Is that the reason there? That definitely is an interesting question, one the coach would be asking himself at the moment. But something's not clicked. Perhaps too many changes. Coach Kozi Gyotoko is trying to find the right lineup. I get that, but uh, meddling around too much or mixing things up might sometimes upset the flow and uh, playing standards of the team. Moving it forward, another long ball for them to fetch, and uh, they're faster, they're better built. And uh, at the moment, their skills are outshining the Nepali players. Look at that. Their star player, Rohit Chand, gives the ball away in a dangerous position. And now, Jali Lov inside the D box area again. Thankfully, Ananta Tamang intercepts it. That's going to be a corner kick and another change for uh, the Nepali side. Then, Bharat Kawas is being replaced by Bikram Lama. So, finally, we see Bikram Lama and the midfielder. Is replacing the forward player Bharat Kawas, Bikram Lama. We've been questioning where he was throughout this game. Was red carded in the first game uh, against Philippines in Manila, Philippines itself. That was a home game for Philippines, and then missed the next match against Yemen. Meanwhile, corner kick, captain takes it, headed out, still not out of danger. Oh well, it's going to be an offside, won't it? Yeah. Found the ball, but uh, was behind the line of defense. Kiran Limbu is quick to realize, sense an opportunity. Anjan Bista won't get there, will he? Two defenders guarding that. In fact, he does. Steals it away. Vishal Rai. Slowing things down here. That's not a bad ploy. Kamal Shrestha now, rather than giving the ball away. Maintain possession. It's just that short time of play that they've got to click as a unit and then suddenly the entire team gets in behind the energy Bimal Ghartimagar long distance effort misses it on the first attempt could not grip it but uh, on the second attempt he's collected the ball fairly so another goal kick then danger has been avoided long distance effort won't help because the goal lead will uh, have his eyes on the ball throughout the ball is in the air so it's going to be easy it's going to be just regulationary let's have a look at the replay again here then Bimal Gharti Magar from way outside the D-box area producing that shot and although on target not enough power not the right direction not tricky enough nothing spectacular Formal on the ball kept the crowd excited. And a sorry looking dugout then for the Nepali side. Coach Rajukaji Shakya there. He's the coach for the under 23 side. The head coach, Kozi Gyotoko, won't be happy with Nepal's performance. He'll be very disappointed. Well, playing for a draw, he would have been happy with the draw, is what he said yesterday in the press conference. But... Oh, Bimal Ghartibagar with a chance. It's a golden chance, and that's going to go in. Bimal Ghartibagar does it again for Nepal. Can you believe that? That mistake proved too costly. Mistake outside the B-box area from the Tazakistan defense line. And the first time they've made that mistake. And Bimal Ghartibagar said, I have something to say about that. And safely negotiated that ball. 
and make sure that he gets the back of the net when he was going one on one with the goalkeeper. What an excellent effort that was! And Bimal Khati Magar finally gives the crowd something to cheer about. The star is back and is back on form. Look at that! That slight fumble, that deflection, Bimal Khati Magar, the touch, absolutely perfect. So then, Nepal are back in the game. 2-1 now, but uh, that confidence and the momentum will keep them going. And if you are to take the previous game, if you are to take the younger side's game, then every time they get that first goal in quick succession, they go forward and produce that second goal as well. So the five minutes to follow after that first goal will be pretty interesting to watch. Here we go. Vikram Lama to Vipal Ghati Magar. See the crescendo when the goal was hit, like people backing up the team. They want to, they came here, they converted in large number to see the team win. And Bimal Ghartimagar provided with the opportunity, with a ray of hope they can come back in the game. If not win, at least a draw. Now the draw is absolutely on the card with just 10, 12 minutes passed in the game. What do you think, Suras? Can we pull off a draw? That will make Koji Gaya to the Japanese coast happy. And goal will make him absolutely exalted. What do you think? Yeah, and immediately stressing on that point, the coach for Tazakistan, Khakim, who's from Russia, has made that change, that important change of bringing out the forward player Vasi of Dilshot. And uh, he was the goal scorer as well, but he's bringing in a midfielder. So, defensive ploy now. And also now, another substitution for the Nepal side. Jersey number eight, Vishal Rai, has been moved out, rightly so. We've not seen his presence in the football arena as of yet today's game. And uh, Prince George Karki, the debutant, makes way inside with the Nepali shirt for the first time in his life. So the debutant, the young gun, Prince George Karki, will look to play attacking, will look to produce that uh, opportunity for them to equalize the scores another forward player so Nepal's going for forward attacking Tajikistan going for defense danger not dealt with and it has now and that is why you need Bikram Lama he's a player that can move around a lot whenever required he can get behind he can come to the rescue of the defensive players as well and that's what he did exactly what he did on that occasion but he's hurt himself here on the process it's not been long that Bikram Lama has uh, Come in the middle and here's the goal for you, Bimal Ghati Magar. That soft touch to take control of the ball and that cheeky little flick towards the left of the goalkeeper, which the goalkeeper missed and uh, no one to defend that. It was going to go in. Beautifully done. No time for celebration for Bimal. He's just in a rush to save the timing because he has to do a lot if he have to pull this game back. At least a draw also. From now, the strategy of both the goals must have changed before Tajikistan were relaxing, they were trying to save They were trying to save the timing and not get Nepal any chance to score. Now having said that deficit is cut down to one. Now the game is wide open, crowd is happy and everybody as you see this atmosphere has just changed from it was stunned silence and the crescendo is getting louder and louder with Nepal and the substitution made with Prince Jose and Bimal Ghartimagar just striking the ball at hard and with the target and already scored a goal. Still in the air, Roy Chand, the only one player from the national side whose height perhaps matches up with the Tajikistan players and the belt as well. Very strong lad. Bimal Ghartimagar will be among those ranks as well. It's been a great revelation for Nepali football, Bimal Ghati Magar. And you can see why. Now the captain, Fatkullo. Suddenly there's some amount of energy in this defense line. The midfield looks uh, to be springing out. Looks to be blooming. Astrorov. Now Nazarov. Back to Nazarov. One to one pass played. Intercepted well there. Another Tamang. Another interception. Another slide. This time brings the player down. As Sony Panchanbe has been brought down, which means it's going to be a free kick for Tajikistan in a considerably dangerous position. The 
the captain specializes in taking those free kicks and it's no surprise that he's lining himself up do you want a distraction let's have a look at that then what happened another tamang intercepted the ball well on the first occasion but on the second occasion just uh, not going for the ball player being brought down but Kullo now Kiran Limbu lines himself up so does the wall referee blows the whistle Patkullo with a charge, no, short pass and a back flick and uh, Yeah, very ambitious to say the least Long ball played in Finds Prince Karki Prince Karki now gets his first touch on the ball Showing off his dribbling skills Pass the ball would be the doctor's order Rohit Chand now Anjan Bista puts the ball in. Oh, the defense is there to rescue. Anjan Bista can still get the ball. It's been cleared though. Kamal Shrestha. Oh, lands at the feet of Dazilov. Chalilov. Chalilov has been pushed. And Tamang referee says play on. They just still not dealt with. Clear the ball would be what's required. And they've not. So Jalilov is back on his feet. And now the captain. Still Jalilov. And finally, Kiran Limbu gets possession. Quick ball played out. What were the defenders thinking? Playing around with the ball inside your own D box area. Again, again, that's the mistake. And uh, do they have a price to pay? Again, Kiran Limbu. Two defensive lapses. And twice, the Nepali team have received that uh, getaway. Can't afford to make those mistakes, especially at uh, this time of the game. Prince Karki again. Brought down. Beg your pardon, that was Suzal Shrestha, was it? Yeah, Suzal. Free kick taken quickly. Anjan Bista supplies the ball in. Rohit Chand is there to receive it. Prince Karki has the touch in the ball inside the D-box area. Can't do anything as of yet. Anjan Bista with that pass attempted to arrive at Bimal Bharti Magar's feet. It does in the end after some deviation. Viraj Mahajan. Vikram Lama. Vikram Lama loses the ball. And chance for a counter attack here for the Tazakistan side now. Zuraboe passes it. Jalilov Chordi misses. Much to the dismay of the Tazakistan fans watching back home. And much to the delight of this Nepali crowd present here in the stadium. Just look at that. What an opportunity it was. Zuraboe. Excellent pass there to Jalilov and Jalilov could not score in a goalkeeper less goal post. Can you believe that? How costly is that going to prove? So three getaways in consecutive minutes for the Nepali side. Looks like luck is definitely on their side. Pastan started to look to attack here from here Dilso and Me oh it was wide of the goalkeeper that was a well attempted shot and now Tazistan really pulling the game in last four minutes they have already created three or four opportunities and one was uh, just what the player has to do to deflect the ball to the post cannot do that so Nepal still have a real hope that they can come back and produce something for the crowd to cheer or to add to the points tally a draw will yield them one full points and a win will get them three points still in the second half the ball has performed way better they have hold the position of the ball having said that there have been some defense lapses which have let them down this could have been easily been 3-1 but Nepal looks to be there is some injuries Dabrosum going off, maybe some cramps. Has played well till now. They have, oh yes, Tazdan are making a substitute out of him, so he's go going off in the stretcher. No. no, no, he's coming back. I beg your pardon.
with every ticking minute. So the Nepalese crowd not liking it. They want the game to kick on because they still hope that Nepal can pull off the game from here. Something going on the field. The play players are getting cramps. The game started with nice and bright and sunny, and it's just cool. Passes it to Aliyev to Nazarov. This is the holding captain now, and Aliyev.